You know how to do a floater? Yeah. You do? Shoot it, Dad. Just stand right there. Let's see. Just put your hands up. He's the help big. You got to shoot a floater over Dad. My name is Natalie Nakase, and I'm an assistant coach for the G League team, Agua Caliente Clippers. I got started in basketball because of my dad. Um, when we were little kids growing up, he claimed he was the best basketball player in Southern California. So with that in mind, we believed him. You know, we just kind of felt his passion. We followed in his footsteps. I'll rebound for you. you and I'm going to stand right under the basket. Make sure you make it. My name is Gary Nakasi. Natalie is my third daughter. I thought that she was going to go far in the sport in her last high school game in which they won a championship. Yes, I am very proud of Natalie. Uh, she works very hard. She's a non-stop person where she just goes, goes, goes all the time, 24-7, and she enjoys basketball. My basketball experience in Japan, well, the reason why I had the opportunity was because of Darren, Darren Maki. He gave me the opportunity to go and watch a men's professional practice. At first I went over there to play basketball, but they didn't allow me to play basketball because you had to be a citizen. So when I found that out, Darren said, hey, come and watch practice. You know, Bob Hill, former NBA coach, is our, is our head coach. You know, he would love to teach you, this and that. And so I showed up and um, Bob was like, you know, great to meet you, but he's like, stay off the court. You know, <laughs> he's like, stay off the court. I was like, all right, cool. And then I started showing up, like Darren was telling me, he's like, just keep showing up, keep showing up. And I showed up early, stayed late, you know, did whatever they said. And then finally Bob was like, what do you, what do you want to do? He's like, it's been two weeks, you know, you keep showing up, what do you want to do? I was like, I want to be your assistant coach. So he's like, all right. He's like, let me ask the GM. And the next day he said, you're an assistant coach, you're on board. I'll start, you know, giving you responsibilities. And, and I knew right then I wanted to coach in the NBA. The next step would be as an assistant coach on the NBA um, level, or I could be a head coach in the G League. The beauty about, I think, coaching in the NBA is everyone has their own path. I've learned to be prepared for that next level. So in my situation, I needed to be this year be ready to coach. For me, it's always about preparation, being ready, and whatever opportunity is given to you, you have to kill it. When I was young, my dad always pushed me to be the best. He said I had to work the hardest. You know, it was something that I had to drive within myself to be the best. My end goal is to be a head coach. Um, I know it's going to be tough, but I think that's part of the beauty of doing things, is to make it tough and to make people believe in the things that are impossible.